All right. Good evening, everyone. Welcome to uh, welcome to Marketing Mondays. It's really great to have you guys here. Um, if you don't know me already, I'm Rhonda Swan from the Unstoppable Family, and uh, we have been hosting this call now for a little bit over a year. This is a pure marketing call, content-based call that you can invite anyone to, you can show up to, and uh, we're going to give our absolute best uh, of knowledge in marketing in the areas that we are the best in uh, and the uh, have core competencies in. You know, there's amazing marketing. Uh, in this industry. I have amazing friends that know way more than I do. So I allow them to uh, to focus in the areas that they know the most in. Um, and I really like to focus in the areas I know the most in, right? Because um, I've never wanted to be a guru in everything. If you can become a guru or just be very competent in one or two areas of marketing, you will go far. And uh, tonight, I'm going to share with you some of my uh, little stealth moves that I use to actually uh, generate massive traffic to uh, my blog, to my site, and um, really to uh, allow people uh, to really get to know us more. So tonight is going to be my secret ninja marketing techniques. I was actually at the gym before I got here and I was kicking on the bag. I was doing some kickboxing moves. I'm like, yeah, I'm going to show you guys some secret ninja moves. So that's why I chose that girl's so cool looking though, isn't she? Like who doesn't want to look like that girl? And who doesn't want to do marketing techniques that are a little stealthy, kind of ninja. When I mean ninja, it's like techniques that probably most people do not do. All right. It, it is going to be marketing styles that you probably do now, although you're not doing it this way. I have been doodle, do, utilizing this form of marketing to that. It's free, completely free. So how many of you guys like free marketing? <laughs> you guys can hands up. Come on, we got to interact a little bit. Yay. All right. Lots of free marketing. Yeah. Everyone loves free marketing, right? We pay enough for everything else. Why the heck don't we start learning ways to totally get free marketing? So, um, that's what we're going to do tonight. All right. We're going to, uh, I'm going to show you guys how I generate traffic to my blog. And uh, I know many of you, many of you guys have a blog. You should have a blog. It's really, I like to call our blog, my home. It's like my house for marketing um, and uh, our, our blogs on stopplefamily.com. But it's, uh, it's a place where people come, okay? I always look at it this way. My blog is a place where people come to like my house, right? It's your house. They come into your living room. They greet you. They love the stuff. You talk to them. You share stuff that you're doing that you like to do. And then they walk around and they look at pictures or they look at things in your house. And they enjoy the things that you've got in your house, right? People that are friends that come over that feel safe. They want to come over and uh, enjoy what you've got going on. And then they might ask questions. Okay, so that's what I like to do. Of course, I do other forms of paid uh, marketing as well to generate traffic. But I continually and always utilize this form of marketing for me to... Um, Bring constant people to my house. It's like a big party, but it's also a way to be very um, non-offensive and to attract people that really love the stuff that you love. All right. So um, this is what we're going to do tonight. This is what you're all going to learn. Uh, you guys are going to learn how to bring more traffic to your blog. Okay, or to a YouTube channel, uh, you're going to learn how to uh, bring people over to a Facebook post, whatever you're, whatever you're using as your hub. And I'm going to explain to you what I mean by a hub. Um, but it's going to bring more traffic to your blog, attract people that love what you love, build your list, which we all want to build a list. That's really the objective is to have a list of people that love what you've got that want to see more of what you've got. Right. So uh, we're going to do uh, be building a list. Oh, you guys are awesome. Uh, it's good to have you guys. I have so many like really happy people over there. Uh, find your niche. Now, how many of you guys have worked with me before or are in my branding workshop now? There's a ton of you on the line here. Let's see. Hands up. How many of you worked with me in the past? Okay. Followed me in the past or in my branding workshop right now? Okay. There's a, several of you. Okay. There's a lot of brand new people. That's really cool. Great. Um, awesome. I'm going to give you everything I got. That's my style, guys. I My style is to give you all I've got in the amount of time that I can possibly give you, which is from five o'clock Pacific to six o'clock Pacific. All right. So I'm not going to waste any time. All right. So we're going to help you find your niche. And those of you that are working with me currently that are looking to work and find your brand, this training tonight is going to really assist you in a lot of the work that you do right now um, 
discovering your brand. And uh, I don't really talk that much in our workshop about marketing. So that's why I like to do this call for anyone that wants to come on over, ask questions about how to brand themselves, find their branded niche. Because truly, guys, I like to talk to people that like what I like, right? Who doesn't? Who doesn't like to talk to people, go into a party, right? And you you gravitate to some guy or some gal that digs the stuff that you like. That's the people that I hang out with. So why is it that so often we all get stuck in marketing to people that don't even like what you like? Doesn't make sense, right? Stop going after the crowd and go after the people that like what you like. All right, so that's what we're gonna do tonight. Uh, and then we're gonna talk to you, I'm gonna share with you guys how to generate leads for no money. That's we like no money leads, um, but they're good leads. These are not crap leads. I'm talking, this is not Justin Bieber traffic. You guys have heard me talk about that before. I've got lots of videos that have hundreds of thousands, 50,000, 20,000, 1,000 of hits and people that like my video, but they're people that like my video because they like what I'm saying, not because they're just scrambling through, clicking and saying like, or that they like me or viewing it. I'm talking about real, real traffic. So I'm going to share with you guys those little Hoss, my stealthy techniques tonight of how to get there, all right? And then you are going to learn my coveted marketing wheel. Now, last week, I showed everyone this marketing wheel. What I realized is that this is just something that I naturally have always done, but I'm focusing a lot more on making sure the wheel is really connecting, utilizing this form. And I'm going to show you guys what I mean. Um, and it's really a technique that most top marketers use but they've never actually shared how they do it to make it so easy. Because many times people are like, oh my gosh, if I do a video, then I got to share it over here. Then I got to share it over here. And then I got to copy it. And then I got to paste it. And then I got to do a blog post. <laughs> it makes you crazy. I'm going to show you how to make the marketing wheel. It makes it really, really simple. It's step-by-step. Step. You just follow the wheel every day. So you're not going, oh my gosh, did I do that? Did I share it on Twitter? Ooh, I need to make a new post for that. Now you do one thing and I'm going to show you how to do it. And it's going to keep it really simple. Okay. Okay, are you guys up for making it simple? Are you up for having fun? Yay, 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 okay. <laughs> All right, now, Brian, or someone, can you tell me if my, is my video like right in front of everything or can they, uh, am I just like dab straight in the front? <laughs> Let me see, somebody tell me. I'm gonna open up Victoria Oaks, all right? Will you tell me, Victoria, if I am uh, flat in the center or can you see my face and the slides at the same time? Computer here right now. You can pull it out. Can you see my uh, face right now? Is it in the middle of the slides, you guys? I'll, I'll take my face off uh -huh. <laughs> if I need to. Is it in the middle? Okay, I'm off to the right. All right, cool. That work for you guys? All right, if you guys want to look at my face, you can. Or I just like to make sure that you guys feel like you have interaction. This whole Google Hangout Let's thing is like see. so awesome. And um, I uh, are we good, Brian? Yeah. Oh, sweet. Okay, cool. All right. <laughs> I'm gonna. I'll, I'll take you off guard there, Victoria. <laughs> Okay, cool. I just want to make sure that you guys can actually, I'm not covering the slides. What, Brian? Oh, you got to see Brian in his pajamas. See, this is what happens when you work from home. He wears his pajamas. He's, he's, we, they call, we call him his lounge pants. All right. Okay, you guys are so great. Okay, cool, cool, cool. Excellent. All right, perfect. Let's rock it out. <laughs> Randy just said, love the plaid pajamas, Swano. I know, that's just how it works. All right. Okay. How many of you guys right now are currently using video as a platform of marketing? I know it's a silly question because I think most everyone should be. Most of you are. Yeah, most, most, not always. Okay, good. The ones that are not, your guys are going to just totally rock into it and I'm going to make it really simple. Okay. We typically start with our story video and I talk a lot about that in my class. Um, this is even going to be something a little easier as well. Your story should be very easy because it's your story. But this is going to take you off the hook a bit. I'm going to share with you guys how to not only um, create some really great leads and people that love to hear what you say, but make it really easy to do a video as well. Okay. All right. Cool. Um, okay. Now, I want to know this. Uh, because you guys are all muted, I'm just going to ask you guys to, uh, to type it in the right-hand side in the question box because there's too many in the line tonight to have everyone unmuted. Um, how many of you guys, but I will take questions at the end. I will unmute you guys, okay? Don't worry. I just want to get enough of this uh, info in for you guys so you know exactly what I'm talking about. All right, how many of you guys right now are using video now and where? Okay, just tell me where. Where are you using video at? Probably YouTube, certainly, but are you sharing it, let's say, um, just type some stuff in. Facebook, yeah, YouTube, of course, okay? Of course, you guys are using YouTube. Some people use Vimeo. 
um, YouTube's not, you know, number two search engine. You, you want to make sure obviously everything goes into a YouTube channel, uh, Facebook. Okay. Right. Um, where else you guys doing blogs, Facebook. Okay. Great. Uh, Ooh, Mark is syndicating. That sounds cool. Um, okay. You're right. And your blogs. Excellent. Um, okay. Yeah. All right. Excellent. Good. Okay. Facebook, Twitter. Excellent. Okay, great. And a lot of you guys, I think a lot of you guys know the, 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 the wheel. You guys learn the wheel. So this is really great. Okay, cool. <laughs> this is really fun because I bet I haven't seen one of you guys that are using it, how I am going to share tonight. Okay. This is going to super rock your world. I hope. <laughs> I rocked my world because I totally forgot how great a form of marketing this is. And I started digging around in my YouTube channel. I have thousands and thousands. I probably have, I don't know, 10, maybe almost 10 YouTube channels, maybe five, six, something like that. A lot of YouTube channels for different reasons. Like I have a branding one, I have Unstoppable Family, I have Swan TV show, I have Swan Lifestyle, which we started a long time ago. I have, I have all kinds of them that just suited different areas of things that I was doing. So I just started to search for my name, Unstoppable Family, just started to search for stuff I've done. And I realized, oh my goodness, there's so much amazing videos that I've got that I can utilize now or begin to share. Now, I'm going to show you guys all of you, even if you have no videos, if you just got started in this industry, guys, you are going to... This is going to really help you generate and bring those leads blog to your blog, but bring traffic to your stuff. All right. Traffic to things that people want to hear. And then they allow them to walk around your house. Like I just said, your, your, your blogs, your house, like, Ooh, I like that. That's a really neat picture, which might be a banner, you know, on the side of your blog. It might be one of your menu tabs that say travel or that say health and fitness, all kinds of different stuff, right? That's this is what I love about these blogs so much is that we're going to start bringing people to a place where they feel good. It's stuff that you're sharing, and then they start to poke around. But also, it's going to help you get more traffic uh, quicker. All right, so let me. I'm going to. I'm going to stop talking. So I want to just get to it because tonight I'm going to show. I'm going to just show you guys. I'm not going to use as many slides. I got a couple, but I'm going to show you guys what I'm talking about. All right, so here's my stealthy techniques and the things that um I just really have never shown publicly. I've made clearly on one video alone, probably over a hundred thousand dollars, one video alone, one share. And I'm going to show you which one it was. Um, and I'm going to show you exactly how to do it. All right. Um, this is my secret. All right. Testimonial videos to special people, right? Whether it be a author, a writer, a guru, someone has done something amazing that has massive followers, right? Book reviews gratitude and thank you videos and something you learn from a teaching from them. Okay. So I'm just going to run through this quickly because I'm going to show you guys what I'm talking about. I have done so many of these exact video, these exact videos here and shared them on forums, pages, um, posts, comments, replies. What happens? We start to do this guys. This is totally in, in invasive. It's is non-invasive. I mean, you go and you share something that you learn from this person, a book, um, uh, maybe a lesson, you know, if, if it's a marketing person and I'll show you guys the people and how to do it. But guys, this is such an untapped market, but we're going to have a couple of rules before we leave because I want to make sure that we don't bombard certain people. <laughs> you guys all have a certain niche and we, there's so many ways of doing this guys. It will blow your mind. All right. Let me make sure you guys are good. Hands up. No questions yet. Right. You guys ready to rock it out? Okay, sweet. Um, yeah, I did. Oh yeah. Screen show panel. Oh, thanks buddy. Um, I am recording it through GoTo. Yeah. Thank you. He's like screen show panel. Okay, good. Free, uh, free, the screen flow showing great. Um, it was just really to show my face. I don't know, you guys don't have to see my face anymore. <laughs> All right. I just forgot that it was up there, but I want to make sure you guys have like a little life to slides because this whole new Google Hangout thing is just so awesome. Having all this life to slides and I love it. So um, and we're going to be doing Google Hangout sooner or later, but the interaction is what I really need uh, typically. So that's why I like to do the webinars. Okay. All right, guys, let's rock this thing. All right. Rules, no spamming. You must be legitimate when you're sharing and creating a video uh, and you're doing these testimonials, you're doing these share videos. I'm going to show you, um, you have to have a link to a blog. Okay. Only have links to blogs. Certainly you can send them over to YouTube channels, but you're going to be using YouTube most likely. You can send them to Facebook pages, but no 
sales pages. Okay. Can we all put our hand up? Like it's, you're putting your right hand up and says, I promise to <laughs> abide by the rules. No spamming, be legitimate, be authentic, have links to blogs only and no sales pages. Okay. Hands up. I got to have everyone's commitment. I promise. <laughs> Yay. Okay. I promise not to spam. Okay. I promise to. And this is why this form of marketing and the reason you guys are awesome. Thank you. I had every single person put their hand up almost. Okay. This form of marketing guys is very special and it's a really fantastic way for you guys to just do some amazing stuff and to share and to begin to start sharing to your niche stuff about you and to uh, get a lot more traffic. Now, the reason why I say no sales pages is probably for a very obvious reason. Facebook, YouTube, you know, people's channels, you start spamming someone's channel, they are going to be ticked off. Someone's Facebook page, you're going to get kicked off, you're going to get booted, and you're not going to get any respect, okay? If we do link spamming, page, sales page spamming, it's not going to work for you, and you're going to get blackballed, stuff's going to, bad stuff will happen, right? And it'll stop some of the marketing that I do, and I don't want it to stop. Okay, I want you guys to benefit the most, and I want to benefit the most. The reason why I held this off for so long is because I, um, well, I first I found a loophole in Facebook. It's changed since then, um, but the, you can still utilize uh, this form. And what happened is people started to get dirty, and they figured it out just like I did, and they started to spam, and they were just it was it was bad. So. Um, people were getting kicked off. And then I, my videos were getting taken off because people were just being rude. So I had to really establish how this method was going to work and how I had to rebuild trust. Okay, let's get to it. All right. Okay, you guys rocking us. Awesome. Okay, tons of people are just, you guys, you guys are just loading up in here. It's awesome. All right, good. Okay, I promise not to spam. Good. I solemnly declare. Okay, awesome. <laughs> cool. All right, I, I'm going to be done with these slides and we're just going to be doing stuff. Okay. Now, you guys, I, I, what I'm assuming right now, and I'm looking at you guys, I know a lot of you, there are people that are from the personal development industry or like personal development, health and fitness, of course, biz ops, uh, authors, okay, travel, travel. These are all kinds of topics and areas that I'm going to focus on today. Um, I'm going to share with you as much as I can. What I look to do is find as many areas um, that meant that you may be part of, okay, that I can show you and assist you right now how to um, apply this method, okay? If there's a different area, a different topic that you would like me to focus on, I will um, I will do my best, okay? I may already have a video for it, and I can uh, probably actually utilize the current video I have. But if there's something that I can assist you guys with the best, I will. All right, let's rock it. Okay, cool. Okay, all right. Congruency, start to finish is vitally important. Now, the black screen. No more slides. Let's do it. All right. Okay. This is what I'm going to start with. All right. I'm going to share with you guys something really special. Let me find. Okay. Now, I'm going to start here. Okay. Now, I just shared with you guys ways that you can not only generate traffic to your blog and create attention from followers that follow the things and the people that you love, okay? So this is how we're gonna do it. You're gonna, I'm gonna share with you right now, for our work week in Tim Ferriss, I have followed Tim Ferriss for years. In fact, I was on Tim Ferriss's Facebook fan page in his video section for about a year, and I have probably generated over $100,000 for this one video alone. This one video, I've generated so much income, and this is why. I shared it on Tim Ferriss's fan page. Now, things have changed since then because when I go to Tim Ferriss's fan page, his is blocked, is a little bit different than it used to be, and he's a little bit more protected. That's still okay because it still works. I'm going to show you how to do this. All I want you to do is just follow along. If you have questions come up, I'm gonna, I want you guys to ask, ask them. Okay. This 1,930 clicks and views. I remember, not Justin Bieber traffic. Real people, real traffic, Tim Ferriss traffic, okay? Now, we have a slightly different story. We followed Tim Ferriss. We took his word on taking a mini retirement. I did a testimonial video. Now, I'm going to play you guys this video really quick, just the first one. I'm not going to share with you any of the other ones because you guys will be able to Google them. But I want you to get a good idea what this video says and is like 
first before I continue on this whole set of how to share this and how to get people that love Tim Ferriss to come follow you or to come look at your stuff. Okay. All right. I'll be ready. Okay. Uh, Brian, I'm going to have you guys, if this doesn't work and it doesn't play for you, I want you guys just let me know and I'll stop the video. It should be okay. All right. Let's rock it. This is my four hour work week case study. I'm going to show you where I placed it. I'm going to show you how I got Tim's attention. This one video. The Swan from okay. the Unstoppable Family. I'm sending out a personal Good, you guys. thank you to you, Tim Ferriss, for writing the book, The Four Hour Work Week. You know, um, we are right now in Puerto Escondido, Mexico. This is our almost second year. We're in our 24th month of traveling around the world because we read your book, The Four Hour Work Week, and took it seriously. I had just had a little girl, and uh, we decided to leave when she was a year and a half old to venture out into the world because. We really had to realize what was important in life. Was it working every single day, 10 hours a day to put her in daycare and to take maybe a three hour vacation? And then three So we took mini weeks. retirement seriously <laughs> and um, got a portable business. We could literally live anywhere in the world. And that's what we do. We take our computers with us and we live the four hour work week. Here's my husband, Brian. In fact, that's a personal message to you, Tim. Stoked. <laughs> he, it, was your, it was your little uh, story about the Mexican fishing village. Yeah. This is why we're here. Yeah, they inspired us to truly live your passions. And with this uh, area that we're in in Puerto Escondido is a little small fishing village in Puerto Escondido, Mexico, the very south tip. And that story, I think, in the ninth chapter resonates so much with us because that guy was living his true passion and purpose in life. And um, we were that executive guy done. working Hold tight. all you guys day. Are gonna dig it. May have more things, have more this, have more that. And now we live a life of simplicity. We took you seriously. And, and we have like assistants and virtual assistants, all of the above. And we also have a little girl. So for those of you guys that say you can't do it with a little one, that little monkey right there, she's three and a half. And she's traveled for uh, most of her life. Because we life. more than half, because we totally took you seriously. Thank you, Tim Ferriss. Thank you for the four hour work week and congratulations on the new book. My okay, ha <laughs> ha, awesome, huh? What do you think? Not that I'm needing you to tell me I'm awesome, I'm just saying, okay, this is this is how it starts. The rest of this call, I'm going to give you exactly how to do this. All right, I showed you this one for a reason, there are components in that video that you have to follow and abide by so that you guys um, will get more attention, more attraction, and Tim or whoever you're speaking to knows that you've actually read it, heard it, learned something, okay? Okay, one thing. I'm not gonna go through all the way to, way to set up a YouTube video, but I'm gonna share with you guys what was in there. First, it was a total instant thank you. Gave him a reason why we're thanking him, right? We followed the, his book. We gave him exactly, I gave him a chapter that I had remembered in. I gave him what we're doing. Then I said, good luck and thank you again. Good luck on your new book, right? I gave reasons why I was giving this shout out to Tim, okay? This was a real shout out. I love Tim. We follow him. I was not selling anything, okay? But look at here. What I'm selling is us and what, and these people that went to his site saw this and 1,900 of them came from his site alone, right, that followed and came to our blog or went to our, our, uh, our page. Okay, now, you have to have this here, guys. Every one of you guys, I don't care what business you're doing or if you do this method ever, any YouTube video you guys ever have, in the beginning of your description, you have to use a clickable link, clickable link, and always send them to a page before anything starts, right? This description right here, boom. Okay, those people are going to see this video that I posted on Tim's fan page and they're going to go to my blog. Now, when I show you the marketing wheel, I have a new system, a new method that I was not using, you know, back in whenever I did this video, whatever this was, I don't know, 2010. Okay. I wasn't doing this method. I was just sharing videos. Now the marketing wheel is going to help you guys really get tons of traffic. Okay. All right. So step one video, we posted it on his fan page. Tim doesn't let this happen anymore, but now I'm going to show you step two of what I did with Tim Ferriss. And I consistently do this. Now you have to be consistent and keep up with that group or that audience that you're sharing with. My recommendation is to have you guys pick one person or one topic, one area, and just focus there because there's so many areas that you guys can focus on. Okay. Now, all right, this is when it gets really interesting. I did this video, bam, that many people came to my blog. Now, if you guys are offended by any swear words, 
close your eyes. I'm not going to swear, but in this, what I'm going to show you, I did swear. All right. <laughs> now there's a, okay. I, got, I think I gotta let you guys see me right now. I feel like I gotta look at you guys right now <laughs> because this is what happened. All right. Tim is a really kind of sassy dude. All right. And I love him. He's awesome. He's a super sassy guy and he loves people that are sassy, right? Or that just kind of have an edge. He likes people that are on point. He doesn't let you goof around. He, he wants me on point. So I follow his blog. All right. So I did this for fan page. Then I go to his blog and his blog super duper rocks. All right. So what I do in his blog, I just communicate with him. And I had a point that I was going to make sure Tim knew who I was. And well, it really worked. Um, because, uh, I went to his blog and he did a post about haters. Okay haters. And it was a great post. And so I decided to do something really, really clever and get Tim's attention. Because what I noticed, he wasn't, he doesn't always communicate to everyone. Okay. I, I, wanna, I almost want to hide that. Okay. Don't look at it yet. I want to explain why. He doesn't always communicate back to people unless they're really clever. So his, this was a post about haters. And he's talking about how these jerks, well, this is what I wrote, okay? He swears a lot in his videos, so I figured I could too. So this is what I wrote. Bam! I put time Ferris. That's really hilarious. <laughs> I didn't even notice that. He didn't say anything about it. Um, if you guys want to read it, I'll read it. You heartless self-promoter. Thank you so much for giving me the inspiration to take a three-year trip around the world with my family. That includes my little three-year-old daughter who was a year and a half when we left. You're such a jerk to encourage us to take my little girl so she could learn from cultures that most kids could only read about in a textbook. In fact, she has more stamps in her passport than most adults. Good work, my friend. Now she knows the three languages and is now a fabulous kid. In fact, my inter internet business has catapulted because of our boldness of taking our life on our own hands. Way to go, Ferris. Your biggest fan, Rhonda Swan, mother of the unstoppable family. Boom! Tim Ferriss, personal reply. Now, I'm not saying that to totally impress you guys. I'm saying it because I want you to understand. Do you guys see the power of what just happened? Anyone? Wow, okay. Anyone else? Hands up. You guys want to ask a question because this is what happens. These people, it, this is on his, his fan page or in his um, blog. They saw him respond to me. So it's got, right, it's got what, it's got my name. I, this was no video, right? I just typed this to him. Now they've got mother of the unstoppable family. They see me replying to Tim. They see my name. They click to my name. It's going to take them to my blog. See, this is the type people are like, who is this chick? She's traveling the world, right? Did you guys see the power of what just happened? Yeah, powerful stuff, okay? So that's just one area. Tim Ferriss, I, I do this. Often. Now, I, if I could pull this up even really quickly, I don't know if I can pull it up that quick. So this is what makes it super powerful. Um, I, um, we were in Panama, okay? And we are staying in Panama for three, four months. I'm, we're at the top resort. In fact, I wish I could pull these up really quickly, but I'm not going to be able to pull it up quickly enough for you guys. Is um, We're in uh, Panama, and all of a sudden I look over, I'm like, oh my gosh, I see this guy do a double take for me. I do a double take for him. And guess who it was? Tim Ferriss. Yeah. I, we see him the next morning. He's like, oh, what's up, Rhonda Swan? I'm like, what's up, Tim Ferriss? He remembers us because we're consistent. And then we see Tim Ferriss. I have a picture of me with him, but I forgot to pull it up. So see, this is what's powerful. Now I, I get to talk to Tim Ferriss, right? I'm chit-chatting with Tim Ferriss about our travels, where to go next, what to do. All right. So this is just one step. All right. The Tim Ferriss section you, if you spam him with a with a, a page, he will kill you. Okay, don't ever spam him. Be clever. If you ever use Tim Ferriss and you want to do a testimonial, do it to his blog. Follow his blog. Find the right time, the right place. Either reply or do a cool video to Tim, or and or you can post it on the front of his page because that's how things are happening now. You have to actually post it on their wall, whereas before you used to be able to go into their actual uh, their actual site. It stayed in their videos and then. Facebook got smart and realized that I was making a lot of money on doing this, but you can still do it. So, all right. Are you guys ready for more? <laughs> it's so fun. I can't even believe I'm sharing all these nuggets with you guys, but you guys are going to love it. All right. Anyone else? You guys excited? Yeah. 
All right, good. Okay, as you can tell, I'm a total freak about excitement. Uh, okay, so, all right, that's just one. You guys could probably make so much money just by thinking of how you can find your favorite guru and following him and doing something uh, for them. All right, now I'm gonna go, um, now I'm gonna go to a little bit on the softer side, all right? And I'm gonna go to um, Blake Makowski. Is it, you guys know who Blake Makowski is? He did a video, uh, or he wrote a book called Start Something That Matters. You guys know who he is? Hands up, yeah? Um, if you don't know, he's the owner of Tom's Shoes. If you don't know Tom's Shoes is, it's a very uh, amazing company, actually. They, they give away shoes for kids um, as you buy a shoe. He wrote the book, Start Something That Matters. Amazing, amazing book. Um, and um, I, it gave us inspiration to create what now we have, which is called Give Unstoppable, which is a giving program. We do a shirt for shirt. I'm not sharing with you guys my stuff. I'm sharing with you guys for a reason, because this guy inspired us so much that I did a video for him and let me show you the video if you guys don't know who tom shoes is and if you don't know just you got to look it up it's powerful stuff what these guys do so this is um i did this in brazil last year 366 views awesome that's still a ton of people i we have so many people that go to our unstoppable or give unstoppable website just because of this because it's the style of person that is the style that we are they dig the stuff that we are doing and it they it, it connects to them so what, what I did here is I, so I have, I did a video to him thanking him, right? Just a total thanks. Um, let me show you, let me do my about here. Okay. Now what I did to make it extra fun, because if people saw this, they want to know where to get the book. So I gave the, the, you know, the, uh, the something that matters book, get his book here. And then I put my blog, more good traffic. So, you know, Ron Swan talks about Blake Makowski's new book. So I'm not selling these people anything. I'm just getting followers of people that really dig the stuff that I have to say or the same kind of people, okay? And so I did this video. All right, now, what I did today, see, here's our Give Unstoppable site. So these people get to go over here like, wow, they do a shirt for shirt program. We do something similar like he does. So it was a really good group to connect with and which brings in, of course, more uh, attraction, right, to our giving site and the, 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 you know, the foundations and things that we're connected to. So what I did today, because I had done this in the past, I wanted just to show you guys what I mean and how you do it, okay? Because, um, and then when I show you the marketing wheel, you guys are, you, you'll be able to do it a much uh, easier way and it'll start bringing tons more traffic to your blog. But I want to show you guys how I do this now. So what I did today, I came over to start something that matters. You know, this was not their biggest site. So I actually need to go to his other fan pages. I just found this one quickly and I did it quickly. So there's not a ton of movement, as you can see. September 11th or 24th last year was their last time they actually did anything on this site. But I wanted just to give you an example because I will now be doing this in their bigger and their better sites um, that are uh, more present. All right. So let me show you here. I want to Let's see. Okay. I want to, cause I want to show you what happens though. People start to actually uh, comment on your site. I don't know if I got any comments yet today or not, cause I just did it a little while ago. Um, but what I did is I took that video. Let's see here. Let me find me over here. I just got to find myself here. I'm right here, right? Yeah. Okay. Is, um, all right. I'm, I'm farther down. So you want to just, you want to, you want to go in. I just posted this video today. What's going on with that thing? Sorry. My site's doing something crazy today. All right, I'm, I'm not going to goof around with this one because I'm, I'm keeps keeps moving me down. Um, but what I did is I just shared it on here and just said, you know, thank you so much, Blake. You have inspired um, me and my family to actually travel. Let me find it. Where am I at? Uh, you guys just saw me there. I I got moved somewhere. All right, I'll, I'll give you a better example because my I, my post moved down too far. And I'm not able to see it. Um, so I just said, hey, thanks so much. You guys inspired me. And then I just copied that video and I just put it on there. Okay, people will watch it. They'll see it. This is a pretty inactive site, so I'm going to bring it up to a bigger, more um, exciting site for people to uh, you know to to, to follow up with. Um, but let's see. Someone asked a question. What do you use to shoot your videos? Phone, computer, professional camera. Great question. I typically use um, my phone camera. I swear these iPhones have such great, uh, you know, high def that you can take amazing photos or videos with your camera and your phone if it's if it's right in front of you. And um, 
we uh, then I and I don't even always edit them, but I have iMovie, so sometimes I just do those little editing. It's really simple, uh, not a lot of editing, just enough to make it look a little bit better. But I don't always edit either. I just sometimes will just share people, you know, what I've got going on. So, um, all right, any uh, what I'm gonna do? I'm gonna go. I'm gonna continue on for a minute, and then I'll bring questions up because I want to give you guys a little bit more meat, um, because the Blake Mikowski one wasn't as good of a um, as a uh, example. Uh, all right, so let's see. Um, uh, let me share with you this one. This is great. You guys ever see the movie Eat, Pray, Love or the book, right? Eat, Pray, Love was amazing. Yeah, tons of you guys. All right. So I actually went to Bali. Okay. I went to Bali and I did meet the actual real medicine man in the movie. Now, not all of you guys are going to go to Bali and do this, but I'm just giving you an example of how powerful this can be. Now, I saw this dude, right? So I've got 5,058 people <laughs> that actually, I did not put this really anywhere. I show you how I did it today because I'm going to start doing it more because I have so many followers. But guys, take a look what this happened. What happens? And you guys can watch this video. It's super sweet. I actually did go to the dude's house in Bali. He did my, he, he read my poem. It was super awesome. And uh, whoops, sorry. Um, so I just did a little bit of um, editing on this guy and just put some music behind it. But the point is, this is what happened. I posted this video up, right? And I have over 5,000 people. Here's my blog, bringing traffic over. They're like, wow, this lady, I can't believe she did this. I got to go see more about them, right? But I always have us join us on our three-year journey around the world, which you need to change it because it's almost five years now. But see, they're just like, what? Wow, this is crazy. This lady actually went and saw that guy. I have to go find her. So boom, more traffic to my blog. More people just wanting to know what we're all about. Now, what I did today so this is a video that I did. Now, I will be creating blog posts. When I show you the wheel, the marketing wheel, you guys will see how it really will fit together. But what I did today is I just went to Eat, Pray, Love fan page, okay? I'm not going to reload it because there could be comments because it, it, it takes me off the site. And I just brought this up so you guys can, so we don't get lost like we did in the Blake Mikowski one. All right. So what I did today, hi everyone. As a lover of the movie, I wanted to share with you my video of me meeting the real Katut Lyler while I was in Bali. Guys, I know this is going to bring me sweet amounts of traffic to my blog because these women are like, wow, this lady saw this and they're going to want to go find me. So what I need to do is I want to do a blog post about it, right? And share my experiences and um, just be able to communicate with people though. Also guys, you want to want to make sure that you're communicating with people when you have these posts. And I'll show you today. I had a thread today on Wayne Dyer. That was awesome. So we're going to get more and more traffic. So now what I will do now that I did this video, you could also do a review about the book, Right. And there's forums. I'm going to show you guys what happened. Well, I just showed you on Tim Ferriss's forum on his blog. I'll also show you what happened with Tim, John Asaraf recently. But So what happens now, I'm going to take this video, or maybe I'll do the blog post because it'll make more sense on my blog posts, is I'm going to go to the book in the forum. I'm going to share. I'm not going to push or do anything. I'm going to say, wow, I love this book too. This is my review. I actually talked about it. It inspired my life. Not really a review. It's how it's inspired you, how something changed your life or transformed you, you want to talk about. Because people love to see transformation. Okay. Now, I, I will be doing this later, but this is how I'm going to start getting traffic to my blog today. All right. From just this little video. And um, you, can do a, you can do a review uh, about what you learned and take that link as a video and put it on Eat, Pray, Love. You can put it on their blog post or you can, I mean, you can put it on their uh, fan page, on their uh, forum, on their blog for the book. I mean, so many places, right? And those women are that love Eat, Pray, Love and the men are going to come like mad to my site. You guys feeling me here? You guys starting to get some ideas of how powerful this is? Yeah. All right. I'm going to open up for questions now because I'll be able to rock through it by the top of the hour. If you guys, anyone have any specifics about what I'm talking about right now? Anyone want to jump on out here real quick? Okay, cool. Edward, did you want to jump on out? Make sure if you do. Hey, buddy. You want to jump out or did you just have your hand up from before? <laughs> oh, I'm sorry. That's okay. I figured that's what always happens. I don't want to catch you guys off guard. Um, all right. Anyone else want to jump on out here? Um, if you do, keep your hand up or just take it down so I know. If not, I'm going to keep rocking through it, you guys. I want to jam in as much possible content as I possibly can. Yeah? All right. Keep your hand up or just or wiggle it if you have a question because I want to make sure I'm not catching you guys off guard. Okay. All right. Terry, let me open you up, buddy. Yeah, because I gave Terry the sneak peek the I other day. Her. Terry, did you want to come out, buddy, or no? That no. impact no. Right. of the 
Yeah. Okay. He's, he's, he's chatting. All right. I'm going to, if you guys do have a question, go ahead and write it in. So I'm not, um, all right, here we go. Okay. Do you think location and surrounding makes a difference? Um, sun seed? No, not at all. Not at all because you're all being totally authentic, right? Remember we talked earlier, authenticity it has to be everything. Ooh, let's see where that's coming from. Okay. You want to make sure you guys are really super authentic. Um, so it's gotta be real. So if you're in the UK and it's gloomy, fine. <laughs> right. I do uh, videos in the snow, right? Cause we're here in Tahoe right now. Um, yeah, it is. It's all in the way you say it. Absolutely. Uh, Susan Ray, um, you want to make sure that you're just totally being real. All right. I'm going to leave it up for right now for more questions at the end. Um, and if you guys are really burning desire that need out, make sure that hand wiggles so that I know some people are left up. Okay. Let's see. Was there a wiggle? No. Okay. Awesome. All right, I'm going to keep, I'm going to keep rocking on that. I'm going to show you guys another more cool examples of some gurus. If you want to call them gurus um, that I recently, Oh, uh, here we go. Here's my favorite. My, here's my favorite dude ever. All right. He's like my certain, he's my spiritual dude that I just love forever and ever. Okay. Wayne Dyer. Everyone knows Wayne Dyer. You know, if you don't like him, whatever, but you can find someone that you do like, but this is what I did today. All right. And this is how I'm going to show you guys my wheel um, because this is the, the, the marketing wheel is really powerful. And this is what um, actually brings more people to your blog and it helps me stay more focused. Okay. So this is what I did. Um, I'll get to you guys. Come some of the, uh, okay. Um, okay. So I uh, did a blog post this morning about my daughter. She did this amazing, gorgeous video, um, about she was sending a message to God about changing the world and making it great. So I, of course go to Wayne Dyer, who I love. And I'm like, Hey Wayne, I have to say how much you have impacted my life and my family's life. I wanted to share this with you last night. I found a video of my little girl, um, recording on my computer two months ago. I made uh, me think about all of the wonderful messages I've learned from you and so many other wonderfully co connected people in my life. Our children become who we are. Thank you. Right? What a beautiful message to Wayne. Now, if I get a reply from Wayne, it's going to rock because I just got one from Asraf the other day. I'm expecting to get one from Wayne. So look at what happens, guys. I'm telling you, this is such, this is gold, such gold. I should probably sell this training for like $100,000 because you guys are going to make a hundred grand from doing it. Okay. So check it out. This is what happened today. All right. So we're already getting some, some movement. I'm not reloading it. So I probably already have some communication, but I don't want to reload because as you guys know, what happened last time when I reloaded. All right. Look at this. So I'm getting a thread, okay? Getting people that are actually seeing it, talking about it. Now, I have a little bit more juice here with Wayne because Wayne Dyer, I actually called him and Deepak Chopra. I have a recording of me asking a question to Wayne and Deepak about a difficult time in my life. Guys, get out of the box. Do really crazy stuff because it becomes very impactful not only for you, but it also inspires other people, hence bringing more people to you, right? So what I did is you can see, so this girl, I'm talking to this girl, her name's Kate. And um, I'm like, wow. She's like, I love Wayne. I'm like, me too. I actually called them and she's like, really? Wow. What'd they say? Well, let me attach an audio for you. Cause I've got it. I attach this audio. Now I guarantee this audio and I'm going to get a lot of people coming over because today was the first time I did it as a wheel um, with a blog post which is the most powerful way. If you're not doing it yet, you guys will learn it before we go. Do not let me not teach you the wheel because <laughs> it works. All right. So that's what happened today with Wayne. Now, when I reload, we might have a lot more people. I might have more people on my site. I'm going to look at my analytics and I hope I get a connection from Wayne even cooler. All right. So now let me show you guys. Okay. So as you guys can tell, I'm super pumped. Are you guys, like, are you loving this? Is this real stuff that you can do right now? Seriously, no money, do a video, what you've been inspired by, share it. Just give gratitude anyways. That's the cycle of life is giving gratitude because the more gratitude you give, the more it keeps coming back to you. Are you guys loving this stuff? I mean, is this making, is this something you guys can do today? Hands up, give me a little whoop whoop. <laughs> I feel like I'm getting little mini high fives from all you guys. <laughs> awesome, okay, cool. All right, I love it. You guys are great. Okay, good. All right. Let's move on because I want to get to the point where I can also show you guys the wheel and help you in your specific industry as well. All right. Um, okay. Now, next example. And this was a really cool one too. This one was, I did a post. I had already done a video. Let's see what this is. At. This is, what is this one? Okay. No, this is Puerto Rico. All right. I did a video. Um, 
for John Asareff. I didn't pull up his fan page. I kind of forgot. So let me see here. I did a video for John Asareff. Same thing. Just saying, hey, John, thanks so much. Actually, let me pull it up. I can probably pull it up over here for you guys to see it. Um, and I just said to John, thank you so much um, for your ass. Uh, uh, Let's see. We're on this one. Let's see if this works. Um, and I, I thanked him. And I did this video. So what I did the other, here it is, right? Bam, right here. 1,081 views. Not so bad, right? So what I did is I go to, I take that video. I go back to John Asraf's fan page because I hadn't done it in a while. And let's see, this is it. And I get this. Oh, shoot. I didn't, I don't think I took a picture of it, did I? Oh, I did a video. All right. So if you can see through my video here, let me show you guys real quick. John replied. Now I haven't gone back. Hey everyone, it's Rhonda. So look, so you check can see this it. Out. So remember All right, when I was talking to you guys in your last class about okay. shoot. I wanted to show you because that little bar, that band um, goes over the top of it. At the bottom, John Asraf says, thank you, Rhonda. I appreciate this video. All my best. John replied to me. Well, as you know, when they reply, okay, to you, their fans know that they like you. So what happens is John replies to me. He thanks me for the video. They go to the video. And they watch the video and then they go to my blog. Are you guys like feeling how this starts to work? Right? So now I've got John replying. So now of course I'm going to be all over John's fan page all the time. Thank you, John. I'm not going to be doing this all the time, but I'm going to be liking, saying comments, saying things within his forum because people now know that John picks me. <laughs> At least some of them do. All right. So it works. It keeps on working. And then of course, now when I meet John in the future, you know, he's going to remember me, right? Just like Tim saw me. He's like, oh my gosh, Rhonda, if you see the picture of me, we hung out with Tim. It was awesome. Okay. I got a John Asraf. So you guys can do this. You can find one of your favorite people, one of your favorite leaders, whoever it might be, and give them a thanks. Give them a kudos. I um, talked this, what I talked about in John's, um, my video, I was in Fiji. I, I talked to him about the book he wrote, how inspired I was. I gave him a certain, certain things that inspired me. And just, so he remembers, so they know that you've done it. You, they know that you've actually read their book. You can't be a total, you know, goofball and, you know, lie. <laughs> you've got to be authentic and you have to be totally real. Okay. That's the rule. Realness all day long. If you're not real, you're kicked out of the ninja topics. Okay. Um, next. And then I'm going to jam over to the, uh, so we did Wayne, we did John. Okay. Travel. I know a lot of you guys are in travel. There's some GRN people here. Recently, I decided that I thought that was just the coolest little opportunity. So I'm marketing it too. So I started to go, oh, what have I done in travel? Well, the Ensemble family has traveled like crazy. And so, um, of course, what fits it better is um, sharing stuff that I've done. So what I what we did, and I haven't done as many as I should have, you guys. I totally am bummed now because I've been to so many places and I haven't done nearly as many travel videos. But what I did is this. I'll show you how I did it today. Okay. Um, I went to Puerto Rico, right? You know, we've gone so many places. So I've gotten videos of me in those locations, but I haven't really done reviews. But this one, I did a review about old San Juan, Puerto Rico. 1,500 views, guys. Boom. Here's my stopplefamily.com. Take a look at our review of Old Town, Puerto Rico. Follow this in Stopple Family traveling around the world. Look at this. This was two years into our three to five year. I mean, we're that was in 10. I got to update all my descriptions. Okay. But see I, what I can do, I can probably do some entry, um, videos. Like if I'm Bali, we were in Bali, we have only places I can do an entry. Like, Hey, check this out. You got to go see me in Bali. Right. I did this. You'll love it. Enjoy it. And then bring them over. And now I'm going to start doing unstoppable travel.com. Cause that's now our travel link. And, um, so then they can go see what I'm talking about in travel. All right. So I did this, right? All these people, you have to reply to them. People talk to you, make sure you're replying. But what I did today, and this is what all of you guys can do. You guys can all go over to forums like crazy. So I went to this forum and I just searched on here. Um, I don't know. I typed in something. People were asking questions. So I, I did one. I, I'm not, I may not be able to see it because I might be buried, but I put on there. Yeah. Wow. Um, I do recommend these couple places in Puerto Rico. I did this really neat video um about old san juan you might love it the girl immediately replies and I, it's not up here but she replied thank you so much so guys you do forums for travel or 
you guys all, if you're using your product, you take images of, let's say this person's talking about Puerto Rico. You might do a review of a video or of a, um, um, the cost that you can get by utilizing the you know GRN program or product and show the discounts and say, but well, you might want to go here. Just share with them what you've learned, right? What you, what you um, can share and help them out with, which brings them more traffic to your blog. See how this keeps working and keeps working. All right. So travel. All right. Um, and let's see. Okay. That was all right. No. All right. So what I'm going to do guys, I'm going to go back. I'm going to show you guys the wheel, the marketing wheel, which is going to make it really easy for you. And then I want you guys, if you already have questions, um, and we may not have time to answer, get them all open live, type them in. Okay. Because I will answer as much as I can, or just ask them, um, in the, the side or, you know, raise your hand and I'll open it up. Okay. This is the wheel. All right. I know it looks very simple. It's going to make your life so much easier. Okay. This is my marketing wheel. This is what I do now, because I don't want you guys all have all these things to share. I have to think so much to remember what I just showed you is stuff that I did years ago. Now, if I start doing it with the wheel, like I did with Wayne Dyer, this is what I did. This was, I took a video, a YouTube video of my daughter. I immediately turned it into a blog post. Okay. And I'll show you on the, on the blog if you need me to, it's a blog post, share a little topic, a little information, make sure it's got some SEO, make sure the, your blog gives you at least a yellow light that says it's, you know, SEO rich because WordPress is rocks. So it allows you to really do that. So I make it a blog post after the blog post, I get a really catchy, nice title. Then I go over to not only my fan page, which or my Facebook page, I immediately share that blog post to my Facebook page. Okay. Now in this instance, I also shared it on Wayne's page, right? So you just copy and paste of that link of your, um, of that blog post. Then I immediately share it to Twitter and then I immediately share it to through email. Okay. So what happens? Blog post, share, 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 share. Then I go to my list. See, as you're building a list, I write a little, and I'm the worst writer, I, I think. I write a really lame uh, little email, but I send it to my list. Like, hey guys, this is really awesome, but this is what happened today. My little daughter inspired me, and um, I have a video for you. So you do that little lame email, just basic. I mean, I do lame ones. Uh, Vincent and Mark, they do such long, gorgeous emails. I'm just not a great emailer. <laughs> so what I, what you do, you don't give them all the juice. You bring them back to your blog. See, this is the secret that how so many top leaders have so much more traffic to their blog because you do the wheel, but we've never really shared the wheel. So you start with your video, bring it to your blog. So here's the post today. Okay. Here's my post today. Many of you guys probably got it because a lot of you guys are on my list is I, gosh darn it. This thing keeps getting me stuck. Um, okay. So now I take, all you do is just take that, you know, that post and I copied it and I put it into an email, an, you know, a Weber email. And I just said, Hey guys, take a look. It's a great video. My little girl made come on over here and see it. You don't give it to them. Come on over here and see it. So what I did is I just did a screenshot of this video. So it looks like a video in my email, but I link that picture to my blog. Okay. To get this, see, this is the little secret ninja moves that not everyone tells you what they do. It's really brilliant. Okay. Um, either one, Giselle, she asked fan book page or personal page. I typically share it to all of them right? Cause I have a different audience. So I share it to all of my fan pages. I have two fan pages, branding page, my personal page. I just share my stuff. Now it brings more people here. Okay. So now in your wheel, now all you just do is you get that one video done. Right. And then, you know, you know, I've shared a couple little things about our project. It connects to Wayne Dyer stuff, traveling with a purpose. I, it just brings more people so they can see more of what you do. So when you do the wheel, all you do, do the video. Put it as a blog post immediately. I do most all my blog posts or video because that's what I like to communicate with. But then it's shared, shared blog posts or shared right here, bam, immediately. Then you make an email, send it to your list, invite them to your blog. By let me show you if I can show you guys actually that email. I think you guys really like that email. Let's see if I can find it. 
Um, if I can find that email, if you guys have it, you'll, you'll know what I mean. I, what I did is I just took a, um, I just took a copy of that, that, uh, picture of Hanalei and put the, the screenshot shot of that video. So it looks like a video. So they think they're getting the video there. Boom. You got to go to my blog. Okay. Just brings more traffic and more attention. All right. I know I talked so fast, but I did get it done under one hour. And I uh, want to make sure that you guys I give you guys plenty of time to ask some questions. So right now, um, any of you guys that have your hand up, take it down and then we'll bring it back up. If you have a question, I'm un uh, undo your questions. Uh, but Kaylee, you asked, how do you do a screenshot? Okay. I do screenshots in two different ways. I showed you guys earlier, this little guy up in the right-hand corner, I use Jing, Jing, Jing.com to allows you to, uh, send to take screenshots allows you to do little mini videos like i did that john asaraf one and allows you to turn it into a link now someone can help me on this i have not been able to find how to take my jing photo and put it into a weber so i do a um a partial screenshot and, and on a mac it's shift control four okay get this little hash bar guy and i do this it's what i want to screenshot with and it takes a picture and it goes to my desktop. That's what I use in Aweber. I use Jing for everything else, for doing little mini videos, little captures, but that's how I uh, do screenshots. And then it's an image and I just upload it like an image. Then I um, connect it to the little link and I send them to my blog, okay? All right, okay, hands are up. Are you guys ready? If you guys have questions, I wanna answer your questions. Those of you the hands are up. All right, Elizabeth, if you have a question, I'm gonna unmute you. Are you, uh, hi, lovely, you have a question? Uh, no. Ah, okay, did you guys, did you didn't hear you. That's all right, I just said to take the hands down. Just for those of you guys who still are hands are up, you click that little hand, it'll take you down. I just wanna get the, there you go, thanks, sweetie. I just wanna make sure all of you that have a question will get them answered, um, and I'm not freaking anyone out, opening up their line if they don't want to. Uh, Jean, do you have a question, buddy? Jean, no? Hands up, okay, all right. That's what, okay, that's what happens. I want to make sure those of you guys that do have your hands up will get your question answered. Um, I know it gets, there's so many of you guys tonight. It gets a little crazy because you're probably listening to another call at the same time. I get it. Okay, Terry, you want to uh, ask one? Do me, give me a double hand up. Yeah, Terry? Yes, no, maybe so? <laughs> no, Terry. It's six o'clock. Oh, there's my creepy computer. You guys know Creepy Steve. He always tells me what time it is. All right, there you go, Susan. Thank you. That was a double click. Thank you, Susan. All right, lovely. Oh, okay. On your video, yes. in our blog, my blog goes to the second tab and it doesn't go on the first page. What do you mean by that? When you do a blog post here, okay, you will want to copy this. Oh. See, see that? If you're. Oh, if okay. You're, so when I do a video, I go into, you know, the, uh, the blog. So I do a post. I'm not sure about your question, Susan. Okay, because I'm, I'm sitting here, I do a blog, and I do the expert, and I do some content and all like that, but it then doesn't go to the first page. Uh, do, do it just depends on, okay, um, th th well, this could be more of a blogging question um, than this formula, because what happens, you're saying when you hit your homepage, <clears throat> the newest post doesn't show up? Exactly. Okay. Well, there's just a, there's a little setting that you have to actually do. It depends on how you have your blog actually set up. You can, uh, I, what I would suggest to do is just send a, um, we'll, we'll, I will talk to you in the, um, ILN and in, in that just to get that done. But what you would do, this is what you would do right now. If you did a blog post right now and you wanted to, let's see, for instance, what I did for Hanalei's video, I didn't care. I don't want anyone to like go to my front page. I want them only to show up on this post. Okay. So you want to make sure that you get just the link for this post. Okay. See how I highlight it. It's that post's um, link. You don't use that big, long link. You cover it. Like for instance, if you're in a, um, a an email, mm -hmm. you type click here. Now you highlight click here now, and then you, you hit that mm -hmm. little double linked um, uh -huh. it's for linking. And then you put that, that URL in that, 
a linking section so that click here now highlights and when they click there now it goes to this okay. post same thing with that image i highlight that image i click on the little linking bar in fact i can probably show you here um Oh, I know, oh, I know what, what you're talking about. about. You know what I'm talking about. Okay, good. That's the that's the link that you want to use. And if you need to do some adjustments on your blog, then send it over to the island um, group because yeah. that's a pretty easy fix. Okay, good. Okay, awesome. Thanks. Yeah, yeah, you got it. Um, yeah, that's true, Jerry. Upload the picture into your media folder on your blog, and then you'll have a URL. Absolutely. But yeah, there's always little, little tricks um, that you guys can, can certainly do that makes it a lot easier. Sometimes I... I'm learning all these new little easy tricks. Sometimes I do the long, hard way, but it always works. <laughs> okay. Oh, you're so cute. Mark is like, keep going for three hours. We'll listen. Um, okay. But we, I'll, I'll take questions. Anyone else that does have a question? Certainly you guys, I want you guys to get the absolute most out of this training tonight. Cause guys, this is something that you can do right away. So what I recommend is I'm um, doing this. Okay maybe pick one area. All right. So let's say for instance, guys, um, maybe just pick one of your gurus. All right. Let, maybe it's could be personal development. If it's health and fitness, heck, I got lots of health and, and fitness people here. If it's health, if it's fitness, pick some, you know, one of your favorite people and that wrote a great book. There's millions, right? Nutrition, fitness, health, whatever it is. And you go there and say, thank you so much. Wow. You inspired me. I lost 185 pounds, right? Whatever it may be. In fact, this guy today came to my blog or my site and um, said, wow, I lost 167 pounds. I was like, wow, that's impressive. What's your program? And I'm thinking, man, if this guy did a quick video about himself, went to that uh, that book that he read, shared it, those people would come to him. And now he's, I think he sells by Salas or something. Just guys, that's just real traffic. Real people love real stories. They buy from people all day long, right? So you can do that um, consistently. Just same thing I was talking about travel. I know a lot of you guys do travel. So if we do the travel one, you know, go inside your, even in your, utilize your program and, and find, you know, some really killer deals and share them with people and say, wow, look at this. Um, you know, you might want to check into this place, the amazing place I visited there, um, or just talk about the place, you know, get them to your site. Like for instance, I'm toggling around in a couple things, right? Because this is how I have my blog set up. I'm always changing it. So, you know, no judging, just, this is how it works right now is, um, I'm testing some banners, right? Of course I have some ILN banners cause I, this is my blog. I use ILN as you guys know, or you don't know if you, if you don't know and you want one, get that. It's an awesome, awesome blog program. And um, you can hit on my link if you want to, or whoever brought you to that. <laughs> Just teasing. But anyways, what, so what I've done is I got my branding workshop here. I've got Freedom, Unstoppable Revenue, takes them over to a site. I've got my travel, takes them over. Um, and so they come here and they, they you know, they, they get to find what you, what you want them to see. And they're going to poke around in all your posts. They're going to see the stuff that you do. They're going to love the stuff that you've got, right? And it just keeps them there and it puts them on your list. See, this is the coolest little ca capture form right here. And I have so many people that just subscribe and I give them some free content. If you guys go to my site, you'll see I give them an ebook. And guys, I also, I started off with my free giveaway. I gave them Think and Grow Rich. It's free online. If you didn't know that, I give away Think and Grow Rich um, on my uh, on my site. I give them, I started off there because I had nothing to give. So I gave them Think and Grow Rich. Everyone that signs up for my blog gets that book. It's amazing. And speaking of which, I'm going to do a video about Think and Grow Rich. You know how many people talk about that? I'm going to do a video. You guys can too, but let's not over kill each other. In fact, if we actually go to um, anyone's page or you see another post, wait, let their post work. <laughs> Let's respect each other, um, right? And that's how it works. Just respect each other. You guys have the same ideas. Let each other, uh, you know, get some love and then you can do it later. Because um, there's so many places you guys can do videos on. Um, yeah, so that and then you you give stuff away and then I wrote my little ebook and you just give stuff to people away and then they keep coming back. All right. Just based on what's going on here tonight, guys, any questions, you guys? I mean, this has been fun. I, I'm jamming it and talking so fast because I do anyways, but also because I wanted to get it in so you guys could really see the benefits. And I want, all it is is that now your ideas will start popping. You're like, ooh, let's see. I was here or I love this guy or I love this book. And remember, it doesn't have to do anything with your industry. You could just be giving love to these people. Like, I just really dig what you've inspired me to do, or I've learned from you. And you don't have to be as goofy as I am, do it in bikinis or whatever, just be you. 
I, I'm a complete goofball and that's who I am, you know, be you. And they love it. So when you're you, people dig your energy. They dig what you have to say, but also, you know, they can get totally inspired. Tim Ferriss, I, he knows me forever. He can never get rid of me because I'm constantly saying stuff, but I am respectful. I do goofy stuff like that first one, which brought tons of attention. But then I'll say, wow, Tim, the four hour body, you know, he had a book for our body, I did a review about the four hour body. He's got the four hour chef. You just communicate with them on different angles and they keep remembering you and then they reply. But what the best part is you want their people to see him replying to you because once you get that love, then the people are always coming after you. All right. Awesome. You guys are great. You guys have been here forever. There's tons of you guys here. I hope you guys got lots of value. That's all my objective was tonight is to get stuff for you guys to bring more love to your blog. Okay. That's all. And more, just more love to you. Who doesn't want more love? All right. So let's see. Oh, you're welcome, Dennis. He said, thank you for sharing. Love the tricks. Awesome. Fun little secret Jedi moves. Um, all right. Yeah. You guys are fantastic. I appreciate it. And um, anything else? Let me check, make sure. What other questions? Yeah, you guys are great. I think you guys are rocking it. All right, cool. If you have no more questions for me, uh, do a double hands up. I'm going to close it up because I think there's some other calls tonight. There always is. Everyone's got a call. Everyone's got a webinar. And I want you guys to do something instead of just listening to us all the time. <laughs> go out and do it and uh, see what happens. And um, go out and be unstoppable. Yeah. Woo! Awesome. Cheers, guys. Share this with everyone you know. The recording will come out to you guys. We'll be able to share it. And, uh, as always, just go out and have fun. That's what it's all about. All right. Thanks for uh, thanks for sharing. Thanks for being. And go out. And oh, let me know what you thought about this. I'll post it up. Let me know what you thought. I thought it was good. And um, we'll see you guys in the flip side. Cheers, guys.